chat. Chat. I forgot to turn on my mic. I, I was speaking for a little bit. I didn't realize. But yeah, hello chat. How are we doing? How are you guys? Hello Ven. Hello Tori. Today we're doing something a little special. But before we get into that, how have, how have you guys been? You guys eat anything fancy? I had cup ramen today. It was... It wasn't half bad. It, it's like the, been the usual stuff I've been buying. I think I need to start varying what ramen I buy. But it's like really cheap. It's not bad. But I kind of want to buy that spicy ramen again. I'm just kind of lazy, and that require that that other ramen requires me to, um, use a kettle, and then put that into, like the ramen cup because I can't microwave it. It's what I just like pop into the microwave with some water. Easy as shit. But yeah, I think it's just like waiting for the kettle is the issue. But yeah, I wouldn't mind buying that other one again because it wasn't half bad. If I put some a little bit more water into that, maybe so I get like more of a broth. It'd be really good. No good food, sadly. Any foods? I hope you've eaten today, Ven. I hope you've consumed. I'm just going to go to the chatting scene. I don't know if it's still set up or not. It's still set up? Oh, my boy is just wrongly placed. Give me a second, but I need to, let's, let's fix this. I, 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 I have stuff below me, Chad. You have to believe me, but uh, for, all, intent, for the, all intents and purposes, for, for the moment, it, it just doesn't need to exist. So yeah, here here we are, Chad. Here we are. It's, it's real. I I have I have pants. You have eaten? Good, good. Ah, I have a cherry soda. I finally come to a conclusion, Chad. Okay, I finally come to a conclusion. Cherry soda is better than orange cream soda. All right. What what I'm comparing here? Okay, what I'm comparing here is Stewart's uh, classic like black cherry soda. To Stewart's uh, orange cream soda, the the black cherry flavor superior. Okay, it's just better. I think it's just because I've been buying it more often. That's how I can tell. It just tastes it just tastes better to me. Oh, I, I, and plus also like orange cream soda. It's like more of a summer thing. It's like it's dead ass. It's just fall right now. But yeah. Anyways, chat. We're doing a little special thing today. I'm gonna be animating live. Why am I animating now? Because I know I've been promising to do this for weeks. Um, because I'm kind of behind on my film, and I'm trying to see if this will focus me enough to like actually just like get parts of it done that I need to get done, and I just haven't been doing. But yeah, I don't know if having an audience is gonna help with that. But you know, we'll we'll find out. All right, we'll find out. I don't know how this, how well this is gonna go. I don't know how long it's gonna stream because it just depends on like my focus level and all that. I don't know. I've been kind of out of it today. Well, it's been rather interesting, because, um... Oh, okay. Today's been interesting. I had to deal with some stuff last night. It was just kind of funky. Uh, but... But... But, chat. Today, in gym class, alright? Or my gym drawing class or whatever. We, we did, like, a hip-hop, like, lesson or whatever. It was actually really fun. So now I know the choreography, like, a bit of choreography to, like, a fucking Billie Eilish song. Who was it? Like... Uh, something, anything, something like that. I, I forget the name of it. So yeah, I now know the choreography to a Billie Eilish song. And it was kind of fun, not gonna lie. It really is a strange thing that I've noticed, though. There was, like, actually some overlap between, like, dancing and martial arts. Specifically how you use the momentum when you're, like, moving your body. Because I did Taekwondo for a while. Um, I'm a black belt. Um... But uh, when you're dancing and stuff, you know, you have to use your momentum and, like, stuff that you generate to, like, help you move around. And I'm like, huh, these moves are actually kind of similar to, like, some self-defense shit. So I found that really interesting. And then we started doing kicks and stuff, like, yeah, I'm a fucking god at this shit. I'm just not flexible anymore like I used to be. I used to be limber. Yeah. That was Billy. Yeah, that was Billy Eilish, Anna. Oh, yeah, Anna was there, too. Anna saw my goaded moves. Right, Anna? You can tell them I was a fucking god at this shit. But yeah, were they gonna bring up this analysis in class? No, cause I already I already look like a nerd. I don't need a I don't need to out myself as one. <laughs> but yeah, that was Billie Eilish. That's some crazy. We we're simply so good at dancing for real. We're we're yeah we're obviously the best people in our class. Obviously, you know, like the people who've danced before. Nah, we 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 smashed we smashed them. We were so so much better. Actual gods. <laughs> Uh, 
I think. Okay, yeah, no. Okay, so the song we danced to was everything I wanted. So yeah, that was that. Also, Chad, there's not gonna be really any background music for this. Uh, it's kind of just like me animating. I kind of wish I had like a person who was using phone I can talk to or we can bounce off while I do this shit. But yes, yeah, here, here we are. But yeah, I I go to the capture scene now. It's gonna be fucked up because I had to switch stuff. But yeah. All right, the fucked up. It's fucked up. You know why? Because I had to move this to my tablet view. And then yeah, see chat. We're gonna be gods because my PNG tuber, okay, my ping tuber, uh, it has its hands up, but I have the tablet in front of me, which leads to some uh, the comedy of me animating with um, out hands. Well, you know what? That's fine. Yo, Lina, what's good? How you doing? L plus ratio. What do you mean L plus ratio, Anna Straya? What do you mean? What do you mean, Anna? Can you uh, care to elaborate? Care to elaborate, Anna? But yes, Lina, how you doing? Hope you're doing well. Anything fancy today? Anything cool? Anything neat? Anything... I don't know. What was another thing? Need an an yeah I need an animator PNG tuber I was gonna make one and I just I've just been procrastinating which is a big reason why I haven't like been doing the drawing stream that I've been promising for like weeks at this point but yeah and I forget what I eld damn I had a person run from mayor in the class so that's actually really cool oh god I need yeah sorry I had to like bring up my stream on my phone because I can't exactly uh have my laptop screen be like um what's it like have stream labs on it because i need to like bring up my references and stuff uh but yeah that's that I'll, I'll get the desktop audio on so you guys can actually like hear what's happening kind of i'll probably be switching between like toon boom and premiere pro uh while i do this but yeah that's gonna be that but anyways chat i think before we get into this i should probably show <sighs> Fuck, I want to show what we have so far, but at the same time, okay? At the same time, actually, no, I can show it off in Premiere. I don't know how well this is going to, I don't know if it's a great idea to have Premiere and Toon Boom and then stream this. But, you know, fuck it, be ball. All right. Uh, I still have yet to finish editing my Premiere stuff. Uh, because, uh, I'm lazy. I got, I got my lines from Dan and Rex, which is cool of them. I, I adore them. Their voice acting primo I, I dan dan is really great at just putting desperation into his voice as i've come to see in streams and it also appears in voice acting as well which is very interesting but yeah imagine having references it makes life so much easier anna unironically <laughs> like that shot that shot of like uh, rex like tackling jimmy uh, I, okay, I saw a scene in, like, Cyberpunk Edge Runners where Lucy, like, tackles, uh, like, David, like, when he's on the, um, the hospital bed or whatever. But yeah, it, it's based off of that. And that made, like, animating that really hard sequence so much easier. An interesting thing to be good at. That's true. Yeah, exactly, right? It's very good. But yeah, like, you can definitely hear it, um, like, in the final Twilight stream or whatever. Uh, no wonder. Yeah, exactly, exactly, yeah. Definitely, it's fine. Like, if you're gonna rip off things... Okay, here, here's here's what makes you different as a plagiarist versus an artist. An artist steals from multiple things, okay? <laughs> an artist steals from multiple sources. But yeah, that's why it feels fami uh, familiar. Because I based off the same thing Edge Runner. Obviously, it's not one-to-one, -one, so like... I don't think I'm going to be called out for tracing it. Like, I'm going to be open, like, oh, yeah, it's based off this shot. But I don't think I'm going to be called out for, like... Oh, it's Trace. Like, no, it's not. I The motion is similar. It's not exact. It's like a reference. Yeah, like, at best, it's a reference. It's like if someone's doing the Akira slide, you know? Like, on the bike. It's like that. So, yeah. Alright, let's see. I will bring this up in Premiere if it feels like it's showing up. Uh, is this the most recent version? I think it is. All right, I'm gonna be muting the music though. Honestly, I might get rid of the music because, um, well, okay, hey, the music's copyright, but like, I don't have a composer, 
I saw, I think I'm just gonna be mashing up like something from like no copyright sounds that has the vibes I want and just like try to fit it to the the, the actions. And we're gonna see how that goes. Uh, does this file want to open? Cause it'd be really great if it could. So, oh, oh. It'd be really cool if this is open. Thank you. All right, I don't think I necessarily want to do the Chrome open at the same time right now. All right, cool. Okay. Uh, is this track muted? I don't know, because I can't see it, because my two, my fucking thing is scuffed as hell. Oh, does it just not exist anymore? Wait, where is, like, half the audio? What the fuck? Oh, there it is. Eh. Bruv, get a composer. No. Unless you know someone, I just, it's just not, not gonna happen. All right, I just give me a second here. I need to like listen to this. Let's see if I can bring it up though. Do 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 do. All right, where is my stream mods? Jesus Christ, I'm in shambles today right now. Chad, no, just don't worry about it. All right, uh, can I switch? Twitter, no, no. Premiere Pro is just not an option here for whatever reason. You faded from last year. I thought about it. I don't know. I feel like it's a little... Honestly, I might just reach out to them, see what I can do. But honestly, with the current state, I mean, I might as I might be better off just doing this on my own. Actually, so that might be that might be okay. This is not what I want. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Premiere is just not want does not fuck with me today. Holy shit. Yo, Flint, what's good? Add moment. Oh, L. It'd be like that. It'd be like that for real. Alright, I need to fucking... What is up with this audio tracks? Jesus Christ. Uh, so, chat, I totally totally use a legal version of Premiere Pro, okay? I totally use a legal version, alright? But, uh, it uh, may or may not be as, um, you know, up to par as I want it to be. So I need to find a new version of Premiere Pro and update it that way. Yeah, exactly. Totally. All right. It is an absolutely hundred percent. Okay, hundred percent chat. Um, this legal version of Premiere Pro. I it does not want to show up. It actually just does not want to show up. Hmm. But yeah, I I am doing today, Flint. I am doing. I had a fun hip hop class today. I had some good. I had decent food for dinner. I have a cherry soda. Far superior compared to orange cream soda, in my opinion. But yeah. How you doing, Flint? You yeah, ain't anything fancy? Anything neat? Sure am doing. Yup. What is this, dude? Nope, that's not what I want. Where is Premiere? It, is, it actually just does not want to exist here. What the fuck? Uh, do I need to, like, get rid of this again? Do I need to go through this bullshit again? Alright, Chad, give me a second. Remove. Okay, we're gonna remove this. Uh, then we're gonna... Add a source, and it's gonna be window capture. All right, too many window capture. Yeah. Uh, then we need a window to find. I swear, Adobe Premiere Pro. Here we go. Boom! Amazing. It's there. Let's just let me bring this down so it's fine. Esri, what's good? It is an archie that you do see. Can I move this down, please? Eh. There we go. All right. Give me a second. Chat is not looking right at all. We're gonna do that, okay? We're gonna do that. I'm gonna see what the desktop audio is like. But uh, we're just gonna see what progress we've done so far, okay? I have a monster as usual. What kind of monster? There's different flavors too. Also, the one to go heat up my eggplant parm, but I'm lazy. Go on, get up. I'd probably go just warm up the eggplant parm now. It's probably, I feel like the chicken, like the breaded chicken. Actually, wait, no. Eggplant parm. Is that like an eggplant like on a chicken parm, or is that just like eggplant? Then you have like the sauce and the parmesan on it. Because I'm gonna say if it's like with the chicken, still sunrise. I like it. Fair enough. Fair enough. I don't know if they sell that in my school. Um, I was gonna say if it's like the chicken, and that bread's gonna be soggy. Okay, that bread's gonna be soggy, soggy, and like you don't really want that. Like if you're gonna microwave it, it's still gonna get like get like that. But like it's gonna be worse if you just like leave it there, you know. But yeah, all right. Right now, chat, we're just gonna see what progress we have so far, alright? 
I've done some minor changes, I think, since, like, the last upload. I don't actually remember. I've been, like, uploading these as, like, unlisted videos on my YouTube channel. So, yeah. No, it's basically chicken parm minus the chicken. Okay, so it's, okay, so it's just chicken parm. Just really, it's the chicken with the eggplant. Gotcha. Anyways, chat, we're going to leave this. I'm going to see if, uh, how much the desktop audio picks up. I don't know how much it's going to pick up. But, yeah, let's see. This first part's muted. But, yeah. Anyways, starts off with bird. Jimmy here. You know, messing with the bird. I couldn't figure out a transition, so we have a creative one right there. But, yeah. Hey, Rex. Cool. We have audio. What, Jim? Come on, we need to stick around a little bit. And how much longer do I need to entertain this? Please, just go along with it. Maybe they'll let you leave sooner. Well, if it weren't for you, I wouldn't be here in the first place. Oh, I wonder. Now, will there be audio? Will there be sound effects one day? Probably. Oh, shit. I can't. What did I mute? Oh, my. What did I mute, then? What is this? I muted the wrong track. Anyways, Chad, if you want a good song to listen to, um, Come Down by The Pillows, Immaculate. It's part of the soundtrack for Fooly Cooly, or FLCL. I don't, I don't know the actual pronunciation of the fucking anime. Well, yeah. Good anime. Highly recommend. It's only like six episodes or like 20 minutes each or whatever. Highly recommend. Uh, It's just it's very out there, anime-wise. But it's really good. Anyways, we continue. I don't want to get a copyright hey, strike, Jimmy. chat. Hey, bud! Rex, help! Rex! Aha. Uh -huh. Rex! Rex! Oh, hey, hey, hey! Don't bring him here! Bump. Why won't you help? Because they put this thing on me? Okay. Oh, God. So much for this peeking okay. in, like, premiere. Think about it this way. <laughs> You want revenge. Yeah, you love right? seeing dang get punted if Lamau. I distract it, then you can figure out how to take it down. If I gotta bring one down, I can bring them all down. Fine, but how will you distract it? Kaka? What are you doing? Kaka? 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 Ka? Ka? Rex, find an opening! How? Ka -ka. It's moving! Ka -ka. Ka -ka. Ka -ka. Oh my god, Dan, hello. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, Daniel Trades. <laughs> we're we're watching you get choked out by Jimmy right now. <laughs> Perfect. Now where could you be? Yeah. You good? Oh my God! There's so many people right now. Yeah, I'm fine. Want to grab a beer? Sure. After seeing all those berries get turned into jam. It is Dan, the man with a plan, who we stan. Hello, Staniel. How are you? I hope you're well. But yeah, that is... is so, chat. Why are we going to be animating today is... Uh, this this section this section here, okay? Th this this little bit here. Like, we have the base, okay? We, we have, like... We have bald Daniel at the moment, okay? We have bald Dan. We have Jimmy falling over. I don't know how to fucking animate that properly. But what we need to do today, chat, okay? What we need to fix is the coughing, okay? Because coughing is a full body action. I right, right now, the facial expressions, the facial expressions work, okay? The facial expressions are fine. It's fine, all right? It's all good. However, there needs to be more character action. And that's, that's what we need to emphasize. And that's what we kind of need to do after this whole thing. Also, chat, for the, you know, you meet those people, you will be rewarded for, like, knowing the context of this story. I've had to make some changes, unfortunately, that I wish I could keep in, but just for, like, my sanity, I'm not. So, like, um, if I, if we scroll back to the beginning here, where is it? Where is it? Oh, yeah, here. This little, this little bit. Um, norm originally, what the original plan was, and what happened in the stream, if you guys recall, it is Maggie who gets captured and yeeted but now it is a bird and the reason why is a bird now chat okay the reason it's a bird because i don't want to animate a third person fuck that shit i know cat cat was like so ready to voice maggie in the scene and i was like no fuck you kittersons <laughs> and this is what happens but yeah <laughs> yeah 
Uh, well, okay, so this is like based off. This is actually based off um a specific stream that Dan did. Um, well, Dan and Rex did. Uh, it was like the one where they. I think actually what happened in most of the stream, if I'm being honest, but um, I, it's one the way they they went to Knott's Berry Farm for the first time. I think. I think it was for the first no second time, second time. Okay, is where they went to Knott's Berry Farm for the second time, and then there. Uh, they got sent there because, like, Morgana's like, all right, Maggie needs some assistance. Go help her. You know, because Morgana obviously has a Valley Girl accent, okay? She's like, all right, besties, uh, go help Maggie. And, yeah, so that's what happened there, okay? And then, yeah, Jimmy goes rogue and then yeets Maggie into, like, the fucking stratosphere. And then, um... Yeah, Rex and Dan have to distract it. Rex, yeah, Dan starts cacaling like a bird. Yeah, I think it's a bird. And does that. That's like what's running through Jimmy's mind. And then, yeah, Rex, the Chad that he is, goes and grabs it. <laughs> so, yeah. That's when I do have the bottom. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I miss when I randomly had mob privileges and didn't get ads. Oof. L. L. Anna. I, okay, 100% think. Okay. This is really dumb. That this isn't a thing, okay? Mods should be free from ads, okay? Mods should be free from ads. Like, I know technically they can still do their jobs if ads are running, but I feel like it's a lot easier for them to do their jobs if they can see what's happening, you know? That's just my opinion on things. Well, yeah. Yeah, unfortunately they're not. It's really cringe. Thank you, Nightbot. Oh god, I've been procrastinating for half an hour. I'm so fucking impressed with myself. But yeah. Uh, Dan, you, if you want to grab the VOD, you, you can, you're can. you free to post it in chat. I, it sh Nightbot shouldn't nuke you. In theory, it shouldn't. If it does, I'll unban you. <laughs> I'll, I'll let it slide this time, Daniel Trades. But yeah. So there's little bits like this uh, that are, like, different. Um, also, as you can see, Dan is fully, like, you know, not war-torn. Uh, mostly because I cannot be fucked to animate the damage Dan on Dan's shirt. So that's going to be a little thing. I'm pretty sure Rex was also covered up in the stream, but I wanted to, like, uh, show off the collar, so he's not. Also, it's kind of a lot easier to animate the jacket, because the way I can just animate Rex is I can just make his arm purple with, like, one, um, they're just, like, one fill bucket thing. Which is what you can see. I can find the clip. I don't know where it is exactly. Uh, over here. <laughs> like, you, you can see it here. Because it's really easy. Because, you know, it, it's really easy, because just fill bucket. So yeah, yes, Daniel, I'm sure. Also, yes, ads do help me. I appreciate, it. I appreciate all of you. All right, cool. Yeah, happy good to Dan got it. Yeah, I love Dan's new drip. I actually need. Okay, I, I want to draw it, but I also need to draw a like a regular Dan model first, cause listen, this is how I've been drawing Dan consistently in the storyboards. Okay, and then we got Rex. Who just looks pretty as fuck the whole time, okay? Which is really funny. <laughs> uh, hydrate, I got you, Flame. Don't you worry. I came prepared today. You don't have to trust me, I drank water. Uh, you can hear the water bottle. So, I have water, so yeah. Yeah, Dan has the dope drip. It's really cool. Dan's a fuckboy now. <laughs> Dan, Dan's a fuck boy now. But yeah. Uh, in the meantime, okay. I think Premiere is just broken now because it won't let me. Okay, cool. It's gonna change everything. But for now, um, Dan's just gonna be just a guy who's just a creature. Dan is unironically just a creature in the in my fucking like boards and the way I'm going to animate him. And then Rex just has to stand there and look pretty. And if you think I'm joking, here, this is Rex. This is Rex right now, okay? This is gonna be Rex in a fucking thing. It's gonna be like a pan up shot. Is you know that you know like Mercy in like the Overwatch trailers or whatever? It's gonna be like that, okay? You got Dan, you have the fucking Yeah, it's my fucking favorite frame too. It's so fucking funny. You have like Rex standing, he's like, Daniel, do you require assistance? And he's like, it's a fuck it's gonna have like the fucking god rays and stuff. It's gonna be so funny. Man got the hand for real, for real. <laughs> 
If you think I'm good with perspective chat, no, I'm fucking not. It's just a really big hand. That's really funny. Anime, yeah, anime wind blowing. You're like, is it going to be a pause? Like, the wind blows through? It's going to be so fucking funny once I get to this bit. But no, we are, uh, we're not going to be doing that because uh, I'm lazy. And it's, it's, if I'm being honest, this is going to end up being a still shot, which I just pan up a little bit and maybe add, like, um, okay, animation term chat. Um, basically, when you have a still frame, but, like, when you have, like, a hold, but, like, the outline still, like, moves a little. Uh, that's called a boil. So, you know, it, it, in, I'm pretty sure this is done in animes and, like, even cartoons now. If you have, like, a like a pause scene and you don't want to feel make it feel too static, you add a boil. And that just adds a little bit of, like, motion when there isn't really anything happening. So, yeah, it's just going to be that because, you know, the anime wind blowing. That's cool it is. That's icing. I really need to fucking bake this cake. And I ain't baking a cake. I'm still fucking mixing the batter at this point. <laughs> I really should have had the batter mixed like ages ago. I'm just a lazy motherfucker. Thank you, Premiere Pro, for saving the project. But yeah, this is the current state of things. Anyways, we're gonna just save Barry business. That's what we're calling this. That's the name of this fucking film chat. All right, let me switch this back over to uh Harmon if I can. Do 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 do. Cool. I need to fix the scaling of this motherfucker. I cannot have a win. Actually, wait, no, the scale's fine before. Okay, whatever. You guys don't need to steal my tools and shit. Alright. Minimize this. Uh, yeah. So, chat. For those of you not familiar, uh, this is Toon Boom, okay? This is an animation program. This is how we do things. It's really dope here. And we're gonna... We're, we're gonna... We're gonna do our best to see how this goes. Uh, oh, God. Oh, yeah. Oh, no. I would do my best to keep up with chat, but, like, it's kind of difficult to. That's just how my setup is. Uh, but, yeah. Anyways, uh, coughing. Okay, chat. So, coughing is the, the main thing that we're doing here. This big gap down here is just the Rex frames, okay? You know, this down here, the Rex frames. Uh, then we have more coughing, and then Dan's going to, like, reach out his hand or whatever. I don't know why I don't have that fully done. Dan's arm fucking lengthens for whatever reason. But yeah, um, I'm trying to figure out where I need to go exactly from here. Because this full body motion, uh, like if I'm coughing on the ground, like his back needs to like, you know, worm. You, you know the sea bat meme? It needs to do that. <laughs> it, it needs to, you have to like, you have the arch and then you have like the inverted arch. So you have the convex, yeah, convex and then concave, I think. Convex is the upside down U. I mean, concave is the upside down U. Or no, the, the just a U. I think. I think, chat. Correct me if I'm wrong, because I don't actually. I never. I always mix those two up. But yeah, uh, let's disable Jimmy for now, because he is not required. Goodbye, Jimothy. You were always the worst of us. But yeah, that's been that. Um. Do, 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 do. But yeah, um, let's see, what are, cool, okay, this is Dan's body at the moment, so, like, when you cough, your head goes down, yeah, so, like, when you're coughing, your head will go down, and so, therefore, your back would, like, arch, like, arch towards the ground, and then I feel like when you're breathing in, you... Like, if you're coughing, you're like, <laughs> then you're like breathing in, so like you arch, you arch your back, I think. That's making sense to me, but I, I, I don't know if it's making sense to me. We, we, we can try. Yeah, we're gonna pretend that makes sense. I don't know why my room is very warm at the moment, so I'm gonna turn on the fan. <laughs> okay, it's like fucking 70 degrees in October. Like, it is some fucking bullshit right now. But yeah, alright, let's see if we can get it done. So... We got this. Uh, Dan is coughing at the moment here, so let's just bring his bring his head down if I can. Can I grab anything? Cool. So his head will go down. In theory, it will go down. Like <coughs> I know it's not showing reflecting that on the body, but uh, sure, we grab this too if we can. If it'll let me. Please, please let me grab you. 
right? Do this, maybe, please. Oh god, everything is going wrong today, baby. Okay, so what we need to do, actually, is I need to calibrate my fucking tablet, because I forget, whenever I open Toon Boom, it just, the calibration doesn't work. Give me a second, I need to fix it. I need to fix the working area. Nope, it's fine, what the fuck? Monitor calibration, hello? Bup. 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 So many dots. My goodness. But yeah. Also, chat, you know, feel free to just chill. Honestly, I'd probably bring up some music in a playlist. You know, just lurk. I'm going to be focusing on doing this. I might mute, honestly. I'm not entirely sure. But yeah. Let's go. You want to work now? Unironically, why are you not working? Hello? Hello. Why do you, are you not working? What the fuck? This is so strange. I've never had this issue before. Okay, mouse is fine. My pen's being tracked, but... Oh, wait. What the fuck? Why is it down there? Chat, you're seeing this, right? Okay. You see where my cursor is, right? Why is it animating? Why is it drawing here? What the fuck? Wait, have I been doing work in this chat? What the? What the fuck is happening? What is this? Hello? God, I haven't drawn. I know I haven't drawn in like ages, but like, this is a bit ridiculous. It's having performance anxiety. Yeah, no, I get it. I also have performance anxiety in multiple places, obviously. <laughs> ha. Alright. Uh. Hmm. This is strange. A glitch in the matrix? A glitch in the matrix. Far real. I don't know what's up. This is really weird, okay? This is, this is extremely strange and not normal. I don't know what's up. Because <laughs> it should be... <sighs> Alright, so what are we going to do, chat? We're going to discard this for the moment. Okay, we're going to quit out of Tomb Boom. Okay, we're going to quit out of Tomb Boom. Uh... I'm gonna also quit out of Premiere because I don't need need it at the moment. Uh, my calibration's not quite as lined up as it should be either. What the fuck? I need to recalibrate things. This is so fucking cringe. Alright, monitor calibration round two. Electric boogaloo, baby. Alright, red dot. Red dot. Okay. Right, Lina? It is, it is rather odd. It's a rather strange thing that is going on here. Strange thing there afoot. Alright. Bump. 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 Alright, cool. So we got that. Um. That's feeling much better. Let's reopen Tomb Boom. Alright. We have Daniel Trades dying. And then. In theory. We'll have what we want. Yeah. Yeah. Cool, we're back. Uh, we want Dan Daniel trades. Okay, we're fine now. I, we just had to do a cheeky little reset. Okay, cheeky little reset. It's fine. It's cool. It's great. Even, even, even. Yeah. Wonderful. Okay, cool. It's back. Everything is fine. We don't need to worry about a thing in chat. We don't need to worry about a thing. It's gonna be fine. But yeah. Um. So as I was saying, uh, we need Jimmy still disabled or no? Okay, yeah, disabled still. So we have Dan's head here. Um, so it's lower at the moment. So that's gonna. This is kind of the trend for like the whole time. Um, but then we have like bits like this here where the body's gonna like move a little. So I think we should um cut bits off. So we have like here. That's gonna make this bit its own section. Make this bit its own section. So yeah, that should be fine there. Um, yeah, and then we just move the head down and... God, my headphones almost just fell off. Give me a second. <gasps> it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. But yeah, we got this. But yeah. Anyways, chat, while we're here, let's talk about other things. I'd say how, you're, how, how have your days been, but we've kind of been through that already. But yeah, I will talk about the state of Twitch spawn. Okay, so, 
at the moment, the current state of Trish Spawn is I don't want to fucking do it anymore, alright? As fun of an idea it is, um, I fucking hate single-player Minecraft, okay? It's fucking boring as hell. If it was with friends, yeah, sure, I'd be fucking down. That sounds dope as hell. But at the moment, I cannot be fucked, okay? Cannot be fucked. Single-player Minecraft is the fucking most boring experience of my life, and I'm pretty sure you guys could tell that as well, alright? I'm pretty sure you guys could tell that. Because, um, just like with the whole, like, you know, hardcore Minecraft thing, it just, it, it didn't feel good to stream it. Like, I wasn't having fun with it. And then also, like, I don't know, I feel like you guys can also just tell I'm not having my fun with it. I, I say that purely from, like, a viewer count perspective, but, like, eh. It's just not great. You know? Like, if I'm gonna stream something, I'd rather have, you know, fun with it, which is, like, you know. Well, I'm doing this now. Also, because I need to get my fucking work done, and I haven't been doing that. <laughs> but, you know, I thought this might be a decent solution compared to, like, being in the labs. But, yeah. Like, if I'm going to stream, I want it to be for fun. Because at the end of the day, um, like, you know, sure, I want this to be kind of a job in my future, potentially. But, again, it still needs to be fun. Like, I still need to derive some enjoyment for it, because I don't want to stream for, like, stay like, yeah purely the bag like no i want to make an audience you know i actually want to make a community which i feel like i've been doing you know slowly been growing even though it is like a large overlap with the mythos community that's fine honestly it's really dope having you guys here but i do want to like make my own community and all that stuff we're making progress towards that right uh hold on a second all right That's fine, I think. But yeah. So that so that's that. Um I might wait on the Twitch spawn thing, just I don't know. Doing a hundred days for Minecraft alone sounds mind bogglingly boring. Like it sounds ridiculously boring. However, okay, I might it might be kind of thing where I just drag some of my other friends into doing like a hundred days challenge with me. Insanity inducing. Yeah, exactly. Exactly. Like, it's just boring. Like, everyone plays Minecraft, okay? Just, every, everyone's fucking seen Minecraft. Everyone's seen Minecraft Hardcore, which is why, you know, you get into the modded scene. Which is why things like Mythos are, you know... Mythos, I, Mythos is great. I will, I will say this for until it happens. Mythos doesn't have the audience it deserves for how much, like, work everyone puts into the project. But people see the passion, which is why, you know, people follow it, you know? But it hasn't, like, exploded like, you know, Origins did. I don't know much about Origins. I don't know how it got so popular, if I'm being honest. Um, that might be a question I need to ask Marshy. I don't know if Marshy's even been from the there from the beginning of Origins. I don't know if Naya has either. I don't talk to Naya a whole lot. I think I've, I've talked to them, like, a few times. But, yeah. I don't know, but myth mythos, it ha it hasn't popped off like, popped off, popped off. You know, if that makes sense. Like, don't get me wrong, it's fucking great. I adore mythos, amazing, immaculate. But yeah, it it doesn't have the audience it deserves. Like I swear, like all my friends deserve to be like netting like one at least one k channel viewers like when they fucking start streaming. But yeah. Yeah, Mythos definitely deserves a lar larger audience. Naya hasn't, although I'm not sure about Marshy. Yeah, okay, cool. That's good to know. Yeah, I don't know much about Origins. Um, fuck. Yeah, I don't... I just don't know a whole lot about Origins. Um, I never watched it. Uh, like, the only real Minecraft roleplay is I've watched is, like, My Street. And this is gonna be really obscure, okay? This is gonna be a really obscure, like, Minecraft, like... It's not even a role play, uh, not even um, you know, an SMP thing. Um, but it, it's a role play. It's a really old one. It's called Rise of Ender Swift. Have you any of you guys ever heard of it? Because if you haven't, it's like this really old like Minecraft machinima, uh, like run that was done by Chimney Swift, I believe. Um, and basically, in that one, like he wakes up. Uh, okay, Nido doesn't really stream it, as I've noticed, or at least uh, not my end. So okay, so. Naya, um, Naya, the main thing I remember Naya doing is the Gaia arc, 
uh, with like you know Swan, Rex, Marshy, and the others. It's mainly a Marshy arc, like Marshy centric arc, because you know the, the whole thing looks centered around her campaign and Luke saving Gaia and all that stuff. Um, I haven't watched all of the fucking Gaia arc. I really should. <laughs> I feel bad. I haven't actually watched a lot of, like, arcs, like, through and through. Whenever I do watch an arc through and through, I fucking enjoy it. Because Rex and Candy put, like, uh, Rex and Candy put a lot of effort into that shit. It's, it's fucking goaded when I do watch it. But most of the time, um, I don't, I'm either, like, too busy to watch, or I'm, like, backstaging. So, like, I don't get, like, the most proper view. But since I'm there, I don't feel like watching it, you know? But yeah, there's, like, a lot of arcs that I've completely missed. Because I've noticed most people say, like, the You Know Time arc is, like, one of the best arcs. I'm like, I guess it is. I didn't watch it, though, because I didn't... I, I I don't know who this You Know guy is. <laughs> but, yeah. But, yeah. I'm pretty sure Naya's cooking up some stuff at the moment. Um, I'm not sure for certain, though. You Know is great. Yeah, I've heard. I don't know his character that well, so I don't care. <laughs> I, like, that's just the thing. I don't know. I guess, like, because I, I missed, like, the first stream. Yeah, you know, the ghost was the man of creative reign. Ah, damn, that's unfortunate. <laughs> he would not have liked what was going on for the past few months. But, yeah, there, it's just that. It's just that sort of deal. That's because he died on rain. Yeah, I understand. That's why it's invested in friend more. Oh, God. Oh, Lord. God. Okay, Fern, Fern, Fern is interesting. Okay, Fern, Fern, Fern is interesting because um, uh, literally, Fern didn't really have a personality until I'd say February of this year. Keep in mind, I was introduced um like into lore, um, what like when did I join? Like maybe a month after I joined. Okay. Nothing really much happened with my character. Um, I wasn't really utilized for anything because I didn't know what to utilize my character for. Um, green hair characters are goaded. You're gonna fucking love Ren. I adore Ren. But yeah. So, Fern was kind of just vibing there for most of the time, but, like, he didn't have a, like, purpose necessarily. He wasn't, like, utilized for much of anything. And that's kind of on me for, like, not planning things with anyone. Um... But also, I was kind of just running, like, I, I run with, like, you know, uh, Justin's group, like, Peacekeepers and stuff. Um, I don't think they're streaming as often. So even when I would be doing things, uh, like, do stuff, um, I'd either, I wouldn't either, I probably wouldn't be there due to scheduling conflicts or due to um, me needing to backstage for them. Uh, and that's just kind of a cookie crumble. You know, I'm a backstage character, you know. Uh, obviously, content creators take priority, you know. But... Yeah, so Fern kind of was just a background character, and they, he's just kind of like the memed green man, sort of. Um, uh, sort of. It's just a retrospective on like my character. Uh, it's going into that. Um, so Fern is just like the funny green man who does parkour. He built the tower, and everyone gets tortured by it. Ha ha. Um, but yeah, uh, but that all changed when uh we were planning. Oh. I say we, it was mostly me, if I'm being honest, when I was planning out the uh, whole vacuous arc, or the vitra mark, whichever you want to call it. Um, not, yeah, so the whole vacuous arc. Um, sorry, I'm getting, like, distracted with the fucking onion skin right now. Uh, when I was planning out the vacuous arc, um, cause, uh, at first I thought you were about to do the <laughs> Atla intro, but everything changed when the Fire Nation attacked. No, but uh, a lot of the stuff changed with the um, uh, with the uh, buh, 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 the 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 vacuous arc, cause uh, then uh, I think cause um, this was like the thing you're going like oh yeah you know we we're gonna do like the Kane betrayal soon, um so actually no uh, we're you know we're gonna be killing off Kane soon like this stuff we need to like you know get this arc done so you know like one less ritualist to deal with, um. And then I think while we're planning out, uh, because I, I I've told Rex this before, like, oh hey, um, I know like impetus is like you know, uh, a thing that we want to introduce into the story, uh, maybe we could use this arc as an opportunity to do that. And it's like, all right, that's cool. 
And then, uh, fucking, uh, the vacuous arc got shot in the head, like, 20 fucking times, just due to internal issues. Like, fucking Marchy was supposed to go on this arc. A whole, like, a whole slew of other people were meant to go on this arc, okay? Meadow was supposed to go on this arc, Marchy was gonna go on this arc, uh, fucking, uh, I think someone else was gonna, I forget who. But yeah, eventually, uh, after internal issues were uh, solved, <laughs> I'll just say that after internal issues were solved, uh, we have Justin eventually got in it. Um, so, like, all right, cool. Um, yeah, this is my, mostly a Peacekeepers thing. Uh, we got Dan, who's in, in Meridian, was in Meridian. Uh, Me Meadows left Mythos, if you guys didn't know. Uh, they are no longer uh, in the SMP. Uh, so Meridian kind of fell by the wayside. Uh, I think Sky, uh, she, correct me on the pronouns if they're wrong. I'm pretty sure it's she now. Uh, they go by she. Um, they they also left Meridian at the previous time. So Meridian is kind of a mess at the moment. But yeah, so basically it's my sleep only peacekeepers thing. But yeah, uh, going going into it, it's like okay, cool. Uh, we're gonna use vacuous to introduce impetus because like oh he kind of manipulates it. Or, uh, as you guys know, null. Because uh, Fern was vacuous. He's no longer vacuous. Fern is Fern again. <laughs> um, but yeah, we're going to use uh, null to introduce impetus. He's like, okay, cool. So he can m modify spells. He can breach literally through the world uh, to make an artificial hole to the void. And yeah, and then Fern's going to study him. And that's how we introduce impetus. And then I think, um, I don't, this is, uh, this is, Obscure. No one can forget Fern. Exactly. No one's gonna forget Fern anymore because he's betrayed literally everyone he's ever known. Like unironically, he has just betrayed everyone he's literally ever known. Fern was vacuous for a very short amount of that time. Yeah. Uh, that's just kind of how the cookie crumbled. <laughs> okay, so basically, uh, what happened? So fucking vacuous ended. Um. I think near the start of the sum the start of the summer, or like maybe a month a month in of like my summer break. Um and we kinda just didn't do much with Fern, and again that's on me with not like planning things with people. Uh so we couldn't really like, you know, Fern's you know, like show his descent into madness and that kind of stuff. Or like, you know, being you didn't really get much of the perspective of, like him being a greater. Um, which, you know, unfortunate, but, like, you know, we're, uh, we're, we wanted to kill Kane. Um, and then the stuff kept getting delayed, um, and so, yeah. But anyways, uh, what was always meant to happen, well, Fern would betray, uh, you know, betray Justin, Peace Keeper, Fern, uh, the, you know, rest of the vessels. And then during the Kane fight, this was planned around the same time as, like, uh, the betrayal, the original betrayal, um, Fern always seemed too smart to go fully insane. Fern's been insane since his introduction actually because i think if you're flux formed inherently you are crazy fern's at least crazy uh but you know he has a heart he has a good heart um i think a big reason why he's stuck with the edict is i, I feel like a big chunk of it is loneliness um because he was forgotten and then left for dead by blood oath which obviously is accidental but yeah uh, was accidental, but you know, it's it still fucking sucks when you know people were there who could have saved you and then they didn't because they didn't bother exploring a little more. And then you know, my he's he was tortured by Kane until his mind. Yeah, I thought Fern got brainwashed. He he, he basically did in a way. Kane basically tortured him until his mind broke. He's like, fuck it, I'll join the edict and get revenge on the vessels. Um, but yeah. But here's the thing, since the betrayal wasn't planned from the start, you know, some, it doesn't work quite as well as it could have if it was, you know? Uh, but it's fine, you know? I It's not that big of a deal to me. Um, like, story-wise, it could have been better. But, you know, that's how kind of things played out. Because, like I said, Fern didn't really have a personality until, uh, like, February of this year. Random thought, then. What is that? What is your random thought? We have that, and then, okay. Let me just do... This doesn't feel linear. Hydrate, I got you. Kane's dead. Who can tell Rowan that Fern betrayed him? 
I don't know if the edict knows it knows if he's still like around or anything. That's the thing. So, I don't like. Uh, obviously, edict knows machine is gone there, and Kane's gone as well. I think they're just gonna assume Fern died. So, yeah, probably. Fern's not the greatest fighter. You know, he his strength lies in his intellect to make weapons that make the difference, which is why you have the impulse cannon. And he probably prays for. <laughs> uh, I don't think I. I highly doubt Ignis gives a shit about Fern. If I'm being honest, <laughs> um, but yeah. But if I could redo Fern's character, like that whole thing, I feel like he'd actually work a lot better under Ignis compared to Kane. It shoots his words over at weapons. Yeah. Kinda. Kinda, I guess. I think he'd rather not fight. But if it comes down to it, he'll make weapons that will give him, you know, a chance to survive. Uh, this isn't quite working. This arc doesn't quite work. Okay, if it's copying, the back needs to be inverted. So we need to like fix it here. Yeah, okay, so the back needs to be inverted here. Actually, wait, can I just get away with... Can I just get away with flipping this? Can I just get away with do? Okay, no, I can't. Okay, I, I had an idea, chat. It, 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 was almost, it was almost genius. Almost genius. Well, we do this. Um, we can help a little, I guess. But since he's coughing... Yeah, so cough has the inverted back, and then... Like, the inverted arc or whatever, and then... So like this, and then breathing in is like that, you know? Do we do that? I'm gonna get rid of the background. It's bugging me. Thank you, Nightbot. Very cool. Chad, if you're not following me, follow me on Twitter. I, I give updates there. I don't have anywhere else because I refuse to like, uh, this is the wrong thing. Uh, Dan Dine, da, 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 da. I need, where is it, this, there we go, ah, oh, but I need the ground, fuck, motherfucker, okay, I'll, I'll cope, ad's gone, ad's gone, amazing, immaculate, poggers, but yeah, um, but yeah, I feel like Fern would have actually worked a lot better under Ignis, purely for, like, you know, the intelligence thing and, like, making weapons, um, but yeah, I I think just at the time of his creation, I didn't know Mythos Fern's creation. I didn't know Mythos too well. Um so I'm like, oh, uh the character OC. Um then my friend at the time was like, Oh hey, you should do this thing, I'm gonna introduce you with this person and yeah, yeah. So uh, also fun fact, I don't know if you guys even remember this. Fern was like attached to Polty for like um who was a Polter guys. Um they're played by Miles Above. Um. Uh, for like a really long time, um, so that was the thing that happened. Uh, and they're like, oh, you know, they're both people tortured by Cain, and then you know, Bol Bolty got attached to Fern. But yeah, I think um, this is Jimmy. Bolty can finally talk. Yeah, Miles has been uh, yeah, Bolty's been able to talk for a while. I think actually. I just think Fern would be reporting to Ignis, like, uh, Fern, mission accomplished. Oh, like, fire? Yeah, you can be more on fire. Yeah. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. So, that's why I think, um, Fern would have worked, actually worked better under Ignis compared to, oh, wait. Wait, where'd the body go? Wait, is this animated on Jimmy's fucking frames? No, it's not. I'm so confused. Wait, where's the fucking body animated then? I'm so confused. So, wait, no, I still need this. Jimmy. Uh, so, we got Dan. Daniel trades here. Why are you disappearing here? Oh, that's rather strange. Oh, I guess I just didn't bother to animate it. Oh, well. Whatever. That's fine. But, yeah. So, I think Fern would have actually worked better under Ignis as, like, oh, you know another smart-ish person 
who can do the job, you know, get the job done. Ignis wants to watch the world burn. I feel like she could have just manipulated Fern. It's like, oh yeah, you want revenge? Do it through this. You know, do it through your intellect. That kind of shit, you know? But yeah, that didn't... It, obviously, that didn't happen. Uh, I think Rex and I have talked, uh, like, oh yeah, like, when, like, the turn of April happened, like, Fern got, like, a letter from Ignis. It's like, oh yeah, uh, your, uh, current, uh, your current, uh, was it? The Supreme is like, uh, yeah, busy, temporarily, just like correspondence will be done through me or something like that. I don't know how canon that is. I, was, I know that was a thing we talked about, but I don't think it's ever going to be like shown. Um, fuck, I messed up something. So, obviously, the dubiously canon thing. It had canon, I suppose. I suppose it's had canon material. But yeah. That is that. Um, but yeah. But yeah. Uh, but then also, uh, just going back to Fern in general, uh, with like the timeline of things. Um, so between the betrayal and Kane dying for the double betrayal, <laughs> um, yeah, uh, more stuff probably could have been done. I was kind of lazy on planning with people because I just kind of, I was just burnt out from things. Um, so we so we got what we got. Um, we had a few things uh that were, that happened. Obviously, there was like the last newbie event. Uh, then we had I had a little thing with Chris. I think I don't know. I was really tired that day though, and things were slow in that stream. So I'm like, Ugh. so like yeah. I don't know. I wasn't operating at full capacity, if you will. Uh, fuck. My notes are shit. I need to not do that and have it be in like this. I think. <laughs> yeah, so it's like that. And breathe in is this. And then we have another cough. I don't know where half of this shit went, though. I'm really confused. Oh, well, whatever. Not a huge deal, in my opinion. Um, Yeah, you have the raising of the body. And then we can just copy and paste. I'd say copy and paste was done before, but like it's just not there. I don't know where it went. Yeah, the head, but like the half the frames for the body are just missing. I do not know why they are, because they were there before, if I recall. Unless I'm fucking insane, but whatever. Not a huge deal. So we get another pause here. Okay, so there's coughing here, so it's inverted back, which we have kind of. Uh, but it's mostly this, and then it goes to this, and this could, like, we get that bit of transition. And then we go back to coughing, so, go from here, let's remember to save, because that's important. But yeah, so do that, do that, and I cut that there. Honestly, we might as well just get all the cuts in right now, so we just have them done, you know? But yeah, so now, Ferns, we'll see if Ferns still around. We don't know for sure. Kind of saved everyone's asses in Machida. Because, <laughs> okay, guys, like, realistically, okay, realistically speaking, if Fern was still evil during, uh, okay. If Fern was, like, a, like genuinely just a bad person who wanted to watch hundreds and thousands of people die, uh, the vessels would be fucked in the Machida fight. Like, they would genuinely be screwed. You know? But, thankfully, not the case. The world was saved. It was pretty dope. Where's the life? Be too smart to die. <laughs> Yo, Poison, what's good? How you doing? Anything fancy? Anything neat? Listen, 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 listen. Listen, then, then, are you sure? Are you sure? He did take a lot of hits from Kane. He did take a lot of hits from Kane. I mean, he's, I imagine he blew up a little bit, maybe. You're sure he's alive? He could be dead. We don't know for sure. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah. Well, that's, that's a guarantee thing. You're upset? Why are you upset? I hope you feel better. It is most, this is just mostly a chill stream. Uh, just talking. You guys could obviously put on music. Just I, I can't because I don't want to and get copyrights because I prefer making a little bit of money while I do things casually, you know? 
But yeah, honestly, I might do more drawing soon because this seems really chill. I like I like talking. I'll see if there's a way I can just get, like get music up on my end as well if uh, not copyright. I just kind of need to have. Actually, I don't need to have the music on necessarily on for this. Um, at this bit, cause uh, chat. Uh, so this is like a little little tune boom explanation. Uh, whenever I want to like, if I want to like, uh, cause if I hit play, okay, if I hit play like this, it's not gonna like give off any sound. However, if I hit this, you get sound, and you get you know get the that this loops it. Um, but yeah, this right here specifically, um, gives like the sound like if I'm scrubbing through like the track, it'll be um. Yeah, you know, there'll be audio. I don't necessarily need that at the moment because I'm just because I've already have like the I say the key poses, but like I have like the key ex areas where you know motion needs to be marked out. I don't think I necessarily need that. Oh, most of them that I have are either disappointing or annoying. Oh, that's unfortunate. Listen, just like get through the tougher ones first. Get through like the more annoying shit first. So just rank them and like how enjoyable they are. And just get through the, you know, difficult stuff first. So, the yeah, at least the more enjoyable things are, like, a bit of dessert, I suppose. You know, a bit of, you know, a bit of dessert, but it's just, like, you know, in a really just shitty cake. <laughs> I'm hungry still, Chad, if you can't tell. I'm gonna make a sandwich after I, I finish doing things. Maybe. Or maybe I won't. I don't know. But, yeah, I do, I do feel, I do hope you feel better, Poison. Yeah, my tech theory were doing a costume thing, but we're using hot glue to put stuff together. What the fudge? Ooh. I don't know much about costume design. Uh, I'm assuming that's not ideal. I'm assuming that's not what you're supposed to do, but I'm not sure because I don't know this stuff very well. I was in theater for one year, chat. Okay? Actually, no, not even a year. I, I did theater for one show, chat. Okay? This is a very fun story, okay? I did tech. I was tech crew. Okay, I was tech crew. I, I'm not an actor. Uh, if you want to know someone who is an actor, Lily. It's Lily. Lily. Lily was an actor. I saw as many of her shows as I could. I unfortunately, um, could not watch her last show because it got canceled due to quarantine. I was like really sad about that, and I couldn't watch her previous one because I was stuck at home studying for like AP tests and shit. So yeah, <laughs> but chat, for my freshman year of high school, okay, freshman year, freshman year, -na 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 -na. but freshman year, um, I had a, uh, I was tech crew for this little play, or little show, called, um, The Serpent of Two Masters, really fucking funny, uh, play, if you, in my opinion, uh, but that could just be the memory speaking. Um, let me go down here. I don't know, but my guess is most places I have to say safety. Oof, damn. But I, I was tech crew for that. Uh, it was my first time doing that. Uh, I think yeah, like my girlfriend at the time was also doing uh doing like a spot op, which is like operating spotlight. So spot op, yeah. Um. So yeah, we'd say we you know we just chill up there. Uh, I was learning the ropes still. Um, Chad, if you ever find yourself operating in the spotlight, wear gloves. For a solid month, I was not wearing, I was not wearing gloves while operating, like, this fucking thousand degree lamp. Um, I also, uh, burned my hands in an unrelated incident during this time period. Uh, so, uh, I can, I do not have nerve endings in my fingertips. Like, the feeling there, it is, like, reduced. I, it's, it's really funky. I don't know. I can't feel as well with, like, the tips of my finger compared to, like, other bits. That makes sense, you know? Like, I guess I feel the pressure, and, like, I can sense the texture. But I can't, like, feel feel, if that makes sense. But, yeah. So, anyways, um, I'm in the Serpent of Two Masters, having a fun time, chilling out with my girlfriend. Uh, like, in the fucking rafters above, like, the fucking school. Or, like, above the auditorium. Um, I'm not actually awful at my, you know, duties at spot up. Um, I, I wasn't half bad, if I recall correctly. Uh, but, you know, I'm a newbie at this. My girlfriend at the time was, like, um, 
she she's been doing like theater for like middle school stuff so she 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 knew her shit uh yeah uh my friend and i uh, we, the trio of dumbasses that we were uh my friend and i uh so uh my other friend uh <laughs> ironically walked in one day and just like ruined all all the fucking settings one day and just left and it was a complete accident so my other friend had to fix it so it was so funny but yeah but anyways um it's still the body yeah still the body uh but anyways uh during one one show one show uh you have to like lock the lamps in place uh during certain bits uh but like for me i didn't quite lock the screw in uh, this lamp enough so during like a silent section in the film at uh, film in, in during the play the fucking uh, the lock just like you know unlocks itself and the lamp smashes into like this, the spotlight smashes into the railing and then you just like hear murmurs below from the crowd like what the fuck was that i'm like oh <laughs> so i got chastised after that so that was great and i dented the spotlight which is even better um but yeah and then when it was like strike, uh, strike week, uh, for those of you who don't know what strike is, it's kind of like when you're disassembling shit and stuff. At least from my understanding, that's what it is. Um, basically, <laughs> uh, we were like removing the spotlights from where they were. I nearly fucking dropped like this two thousand dollar lamp, in like twenty. It was like I don't know, maybe forty. I don't know how fucking tall the building was. Let's say like thirty feet below me, like into the fucking stadium. Thank god my friend captured the the fucking spotlight at the last second like holy shit how did, my parents would have killed me but yeah that's what happened there yeah oh we're just saying i want to have a pop what is that song i've never heard of that song before in my life could they could they just not get the rights to like the mariah carey one you know she saw me now chat she saw me now as we speak Okay, the mass isn't staying consistent, but whatever, it's fine. Mm, okay, there needs to be more bend in the elbow, I suppose, like in this. Hmm. Yeah, there needs to be more bend in the elbow, I think. But yeah, the most fucking shitty song in Christmas. Damn, that's really cringe of them. I don't know why they do that. Why they choose that? Beyond annoying. Oof unfortunate you know maybe i should just film myself just like coughing to see how this would go but yeah the mass isn't quite staying consistent like how it should be this is fine here i think the elbow just needs to move and like some of these coughing like positions yeah i think that's what's just tripping me here so the elbow needs to be more like this like on the ground and then you know okay that's safe i think it's safe your internet died. Oh, that's cringe. Un unkill it. Unkill your internet. All right. You know you gotta watch the stream. It's very important, Ezri. You gotta watch the stream. You know that's the most important bit in all of this. Watching me, cause I'm the most important person here. <laughs> oh God. All right. Um. Boom. Boom. Ba -da -da -dum. Ba -dum. Boom. 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 Okay, no, I don't actually need this much. I just need this. And then just move this up a little bit. Like that. Boom. Easy. But yeah. I thought we hit the... Oh, jeez. That actually happened to me one time. I was, like, chilling in my house. And, like, some, like, motorcycler... A motorcyclist? Yeah. A motorbiker. Uh, he just fucking, like, crashed into a telephone pole near my house. I don't think he made it. Uh, I don't actually know what happened. Yeah, it's happened in a, twice in a week before. Jesus Christ. Damn. No, it it wasn't, uh, it didn't happen. It's just, like, not a common occurrence in my town. Uh, like, the power occasionally goes out during the winter. But, I, it, I don't know. It's winter in Massachusetts, so it makes sense. But it hasn't been too bad in the past few years. But I remember, like, during a blizzard, it went out. And then we had to, like, uh, evacuate to, like, my family friend's house or something for like a few days so i was really chill with them for the sake of the cinema and stuff because you know we sort of did not have any heat the only heat we had was like our fireplace or something like that so yeah 
Uh, my neighbor has four bad drivers. Don't worry, mine is too. <laughs> Listen, I don't know why people say Massachusetts has bad drivers. The only reason we drive horribly is because we're trying to avoid potholes. Right? It's the only reason. We're just trying to avoid, like, you know, losing our car. <laughs> but Massachusetts actually has, like, one of the, um, like, strictest uh, driver's, like, licensing tests in the state. Uh, well, in the country. Actually, I think it it is the hardest one in the country. Maybe New York has a tougher one. It might vary from place to place, though, because, like, I imagine getting a license in New York City is, like, fucking insane. Because, like, driving in New York is built different. I've never driven in New York, though. Oh. Uh, ugh. Damn, sorry, Chad. I'm tired today, man. I'm the big sleepy. Uh, but yeah. That's that's the current state of things, chat. That's that's how that's how we do things. Uh bum 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 But yeah. I don't know, I was kinda of hoping to get more done. I'm just trying to figure out how to do this, which is like tripping me up. Oh, maybe this is working better. I don't know, maybe should we like be moving down more? Moving forward? I don't know. So we got Dan doing this. His body squeezing for whatever reason. So if he squeezes down, then it should be more like that maybe. Whatever. It's not a big deal. If he goes back to this, that's fine. We got this. So then this here, uh the fucking Dan's body needs to move. down here let me take this shit and put it up like that and then we take the head maybe it's because I haven't moved the heads that might be it I don't know do, 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 do. uh it's a back I'm not a down pull ah fair enough do, 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 do. Hmm. Hmm. I don't know. I feel like I want to be animating a more interesting shot, but I know I need to get this done. Eh. Oh, I feel like I want to animate a more interesting shot for a stream, though. Uh, mans. Mans. I don't know. I don't know what I should do. Um, hmm. I don't know. I'm not. I don't think I'm focusing on much because I'm also talking at the same time. That might be a thing. Um, this is a shorter stream today. I think I'm just gonna. I might cut the stream here if I'm being honest. I don't know. I I feel strange. I feel strange about things at the moment. I don't know why. Part of me wants to continue. But like, also, this is a boring shot that I kind of seem to just grind through, and I just, I feel like I'm just gonna do find any excuse to not do it if I keep talking. Ha. Huh. Yeah, you know, that's like what I'm feeling at the moment. Like, what do I do? Like, how do I how do I fix this feeling that I'm having? I don't know. Hmm. I don't know. Do I do I keep going? I don't know if I want to keep going. Uh, hmm. I'm not sure. Do I? I'm not sure what I want to do. I guess I could, but eh. I might find a more interesting shot and just grind through this one. There's some more interesting bits, like Dan rolling around. That'd be really funny to animate. Like, this is, don't get me wrong, this isn't a funny bit, but, like, eh. I'm not feeling it. I'm not feeling it at the moment. So, hmm. I don't know. I think I might call it here, guys. I ain't, it's just, I ain't feeling too good. I ain't, too, I, ain't, I ain't feeling too good about this. For whatever reason. But, yeah. Alright, cool. I think for now, I'm gonna end stream. We're gonna hit Lally with a raid. So, you know, you know what to do, guys.
Say the raid for, you know how it would be. Lily201. You better accept my raid, bitch. Alright, cool. Alright, boys. Show Lily some love. I think they're doing Silver Veil tonight. So, yeah. I adore you all. Thank you for showing up. I might continue doing these in the future. Alright. Adios. Wah!